Hello guys, welcome to SAS Chemistry Lectures. So today guys, we have a new topic and the name of our topic is Dif Different Expressions of Change in Entropy Delta S. In this lecture, we will learn how to determine the different expressions related to the change in entropy and with the help of these expressions, you can easily for, uh, solve the problems which are given in the examinations. So these expressions are so much important for the coming gate exam. So guys, keep watching this video up to the end. You will get the most important information related to the change in expression, change in entropy of gas. Okay guys, let's start. So here we have a two formulas which are uh, written here. Delta S is equals to N C P L N T2 upon T1 plus N R plus R L N P1 upon P2. And next one is N C V L N T2 upon T1 plus R L N V2 upon V1. So firstly we will solve this one and then this one. So case one. Case one is what? If T is constant means temperature is constant. If temperature is constant, the process is what? Isothermal process. So in exam, if they talk about the isothermal process, so this value if the temperature is constant means T1 and T2 both are equal. So this value and this value will become 0. So 0 plus R ln P1 upon P2 and finally it becomes N R ln P1 upon P2. So with the help of this relation you can easily solve the problem related to the change in entropy if, if the pressure if the two pressures are given for the ideal gas. Okay guys. So first relation is what? Delta S is equals to NR ln P1 upon P2. Now case 2. If here change this one. If P is constant. P is constant means what? Iso baric process for the isobaric process P1 and P2 both are equal because P is constant so this value will become 0 therefore the formula will become delta S is equals to N Cp ln T2 upon T1 so finally it becomes N Cp ln T2 upon T1. So this formula is used when the temperature are given and they talk about the change in entropy for the ideal gas you can use this formula for the isobaric process. Now move to the different point. Here we have a formula case 1 if you apply the case 1 if T is constant same means isothermal process process so this value will become 0 and finally the form formula will become nr ln v2 upon v1 if the two volumes are given so then we will use this formula to solve the uh, problem related to the in change in entropy now we have another case case 2 in case 2 if v is constant if v is constant so the formula will become what means the process is what isochoric process isochoric process you can also say it isovolumic process then the formula will become nr ln v2 upon v1 so here we have found a four relation that delta s is equals to nr ln p1 upon p2 delta s is equals to 
एन सी पी एल एन टी टू अपॉइंट टी वन डेल्टा एस इज इक्व टू एन आर एल एन वी टू अपॉइंट वी वन एंड डेल्टा एस सॉरी हियर वी टी वन अपॉइंट टी टू अपॉइंट टी वन एंड डेल्टा एस इज इक्व टू एन आर एल एन टी टू अपॉइंट टी वन so with the help of these formula you can easily determine the change in entropy which is given in the examination so this formulas are very 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 much important for the coming gate exam so learn these all these formulas and firstly in the exam you will see that which relation is given which values are given and with the help of which constant the which constant is given which value is constant so you can easily determine the change in entropy with the help of these formulas so today guys i have told you this much problem uh, this much information if you got my lecture please like subscribe and share my channel okay guys thank you